arrangements to promote the rule of law concept are expected to be unveiled at the fourth plenary session of the 18th Central Committee of the CPC, which will be held in Beijing from Monday to Thursday. Law expert Li Lin said the concept should be applied to efforts to rein in corrupt officials rather than target citizens. The most important aim of the rule of law is to put official power in the cage of laws and systems. A magic ring made up of the constitution and other laws should be placed and upon public post holders, from the top leadership to local officials, so as to ensure that they serve the people who empower them. Li said a fundamental aim of the rule of law concept is to encourage public officials to properly serve the public. In the end, the rule of law is a way to helping every citizen realize their legal rights and interests to the largest extent under legal procedures and systems. This way, we can prevent abuse of official power and the damages it does to citizens. We can also prevent the malfeasance of the official power that undermines the interests and the rights of society. We should directly employ rule of law to guarantee the sufficient, comprehensive, and equal realization of citizens' rights. In 2010, Chinese authorities stated that they had established a socialist system of law. However, many challenges have prevented the system from being effective. Corruption remains prevalent, leading authorities to declare last year that they would make greater efforts to find and punish corrupt officials.